what's up guys welcome back to the channel first of all i'm gonna thank you all for coming back and being active like slowly being active in the channel but i'm very happy to see that it's growing so i want to make more videos so that you guys can learn something from it i'm also going to show more blogs slowly a lot of different stuffs but anyway recently um Central c and little baby dropped a track called band for band honestly it's really hard man it's really hard what is that sign language and so i decided maybe i should make something like that so without wasting any time let me show you how you can make a beat like that let's go so first you have to uh, pick up a scale any scale that you want works some minor scales anything that you want it works so we're gonna go to view to scale highlighting and then you know i pick the g sharp minor scale you can pick any other scales as well so i'm gonna come up with a i'm gonna come up with some chords over here so i'm gonna start off with a g sharp suspended two chord and then i'm gonna stab use this, use it as a stab and then i'm going to again uh, copy that and uh, just go from suspended to minor chord so it goes something like this and then i'm going to do the same copy this and then i'm going to go uh, g one two three four four semitones to to C sharp minor and then copy that below and then I'm gonna copy this use it as a step and then go to F sharp major and then copy that copy as a step make make it all step So now that we have the main melody laid out, I'm going to add some <clears throat> counter melodies uh, on top of this main melody. And now I'm using the XV strings. So basically it's just very simple. All I did is, let me show you. One, then we went from G sharp to A sharp and then B. Uh, simple repetitive uh, notes that are going throughout with the main melody let me play it for you simple but it's just to add depth to the main melody and so on top of this i wanted to add another counter melody and i'm using a bell I, i'm using a bell sound from serum and basically i'm just playing a little bit offbeat than the main melody so that all of all of the melodies are not stacked at the first downbeat went from this So that's the bell sound from Serum. One more thing, to get this bell sound, this bell preset, you can go to Splice. If you have a subscription over there, then you can just go and find there are a lot of presets on, for Serum on Splice and, and they are really dope. So yeah guys, if you are looking for a lot of Serum presets, then do definitely go and check out Splice. So the next sound in the beat is this sound from Serum, uh, sorry, from Contact, uh, Session Strings 2. I just copied the same chords G minor and then C sharp minor. So basically the B and E, I just pulled it up like this and that's it. So this is just to add more depth into the melody. So after that, I have this violin as a accent and all I did was
last in the melody section is this alarm sound from cymatics it was like this so i just chopped it up and made it like this and i pulled it down to 400 cents so overall this is how it sounds Yeah. <clears throat> so going to the processing of the sounds I use tape mellify and RC color red RC20 retro color the vinyl one preset and some fruity parametric EQ and some um, Valhalla vintage reverb and reverb spring from Arturia as well so yeah that's all for the processing in the melody side now I'm going to show you what I did with the drums so first I pulled up this rim and I added a simple drill pattern this is how it sounds and I copied the same pattern layered it to the other, other rim Then I copied the same again and I layered it to the shaker. So basically while I'm layering the sounds like multiple sounds all I do is go to this and I play with the with the section over here. So basically if I have one sound in C5 then the other layered sound would be somewhere around A sharp or, and the other would be somewhere around C sharp or D sharp something like that let me show you so for example ring 2 the sound is at B so I clicked on this B something like that I, I, I hope you get what I'm talking about I feel like they all gel together so next drum sound that I have is this Cymatics rim shot. It's a typical drill pattern, and I have this one shot snare from Cymatics as well that's layered. Then I pulled up this kick from Cymatics as well. It's from the drill pack that they have. This is the kick pattern. Next, I have this counter snare, and this is how it sounds. So basically, if you are very new to making beats to make this kind of jobs, you have to just go like this, select, press Alt U, and yeah, so that's how you accept, and that's how you make a job. With the processing of the drums, I don't have too much going on, just basic gain staging. With the 808, I just have this fruity fast distortion and i just pulled it to somewhere around 41 percent that's it and other than that i'm just gain staging with all the sounds uh, over here so last two sounds that i have over here is the snare roll and this so for the 808 i pulled up this distorted 808 so basically for drill patterns you don't want that short 808s yeah on some cases you can use the short 808s but most of these drill songs i think they use the longer 808s just so that you can use those slides and you know what i'm talking about so this 808 was basically very soft at the start but i did a boost of like five percent just to make it sound really hard and uh, yeah this is the pattern So uh, with the arrangement, 
I have all the sounds in the hook playing. I just have this bell sounds uh, not playing in the hook, but I have it playing in the verse part. And at the start, you can see that I have cut off the drums a little bit just to add that silence in between the drop so that the artist knows that the verse is coming like this is the verse part and i have this minor adjustment over here like i cut off the drums in certain sections over here and then i have the snare rule at the end and then the hook comes in and then we follow the same pattern so here. guys that's it for the video i'm about to wrap up and i'm gonna play the beat for you guys and i hope you enjoy the video learn something new from it and i hope you also enjoy the beat as well so yeah guys sayonara peace out see you on the next video